The central purpose and message of the song We Didn't Start the Fire by Billy Joel is to bring awareness to the fact that our society has always figuratively been burning. Our audience are all the protesters during the 90s and also the government and the generations before the newer ones that blame the newer generation for all the chaos in the world. The context is in the 90s when this came out are protest times. What brought him about to write this song is that more protests were happening since the last ones in the last decades, so he thought that it was time to bring awareness to the other decades' faults. My rhetorical, were um, rhetorically accurate verbs were challenges and enlightens. My challenges lyrics was birth control, Ho Chi Minh, Richard Nixon back again. This brings awareness to what was going on during the 70s and also a bit of loss of faith that was going on during the 70s. It brings upon the um, most controversial and peaceful moments during the 70s like Watergate or Woodstock. It also shows the loss of faith by naming Watergate, which was a big scandal that, uh, that Nixon was a part of that made lots of Americans lose its trust by also marking the beginning of the Vietnam War with the naming of Ho Chi Minh, the, pre the president during in North Vietnam. The Enlightened's lyrics were, we didn't start a fire, it was always burning since the world's been turning. We didn't start the fire, no, we didn't light it, but we tried to fight it. This enlightens listeners on the fact that it wasn't the new generation's fault that there's so much chaos going on in the world, but it's been going on since the beginning of the, of the end and beginning of the Second World War. Joel states, we didn't start the fire, it was always burning since the world is turning. By singing this, it shows chaos has always plagued society. My, logi my logical appeal lyrics were Little Rock, Pastor Knack, Mickey Mantle, Kiriguac, Sputnik, Chow in Lay, Bridges on River K and two, Chubby Checker Psycho Belgians in the Congo. This makes the audience feel sad and angry by proving all the homicides and racism during the 60s. This hel uh, helps pool, uh, prove Joel's point by showing that these events have always been fueling the figurative fire that our society is burning in. The emotional appeal is we didn't start the fire, but when we're gone, it will still burn on and on and on. This makes the audience, fear, uh, the audience fearful and scared that the fire will always be burning even when we're gone. This, this, the way the listeners feel during this course helps prove Joel is on the right track about saying the world has been terrible. The ethical appeal is the king and I and the catcher and the rye. The listeners feel sort of reminisce on these books and how they tie to societal norms and how they didn't. The, these feelings toward these novels and the hatred they face proves the reason the reason Joel wrote the song by bringing back the memories and symbolism the novels portrayed. The tones under this is a kind of benevolent benevolent tone. These this shows up when we what else do I have to say? We didn't start the fire. It was always burning since the world is turning. This shows a benevolent undertone to this song uh, to this that because the fact that Joel didn't directly come out with saying the government is failing and that he hates it. He does this with naming all these events that happened because of the government's ignorance and unwanting of change.